They say only a lion can kill a lion. But mighty and strong as they are, even these wildcats sometimes become the victims of their intended prey. There are in fact a handful of animals who are big, brave, and strong enough to put up a fight that can end very badly for the lion. Are you ready to meet the king of the jungle's most fearsome opponents? Hello there, and welcome to another episode of Forever Green. Today, we're counting down the few animals that can actually kill a lion. And, if you're wondering whether a tiger would win a showdown against a lion, you'll definitely want to stick around for number one, because the jungle may well have a new king. Alright, let's get started. Number 7. Giraffe Can a giraffe seriously kill a lion? You bet it can. Thanks to their towering legs and long necks, giraffes are the world's tallest mammals. A giraffe's legs alone are taller than many humans and allowing them to reach speeds of up to 35 miles per hour. And the horns on a giraffe's head aren't just for show. They could use those things by literally swinging their heads at their enemies like a golf club, causing enough force to easily shatter an adult lion's bones. Besides that, a male giraffe can weigh up to 1,800 pounds, which is about four times the weight of a male lion. And although they're not as agile as lions, if they manage to land a kick with one of their powerful legs in just the right place, it may well be over for the lion. Don't believe us? Check out this clip of a mother giraffe who killed one of the lionesses who attacked her baby by stomping it to death. And, if you think this showdown ends badly for the lion, wait until you see it face off with a tiger at number one. Pop quiz. If you put these four in a cage, who would come out alive? Go ahead, leave us your answer in the comments below. We'll wait. Number 6. Buffalo Lions are notorious buffalo hunters, but a single lion killing an adult buffalo is unheard of, believe it or not. Buffalo are actually considered far more dangerous than lions, and even entire lion prides have been known to attack a single adult buffalo and still fail to kill it. And, since buffalo travel in herds that are far more numerous than lion prides, a single lion will almost never attack a single buffalo unless it's a young calf. Even if they do put together a coordinated attack. Lions must be very wary as buffalo are known to get very aggressive when provoked and will do anything to protect their own. Buffalo are just way too powerful and can easily inflict a wound that would cripple or even kill a lion. They're so tough, they've been known to ruthlessly chase down and kill human hunters. Now, if a half-ton buffalo can kill a human with a gun, just imagine what it could do to a lion. And, if you don't think they could put up a fight, just look at this clip of a buffalo flinging a lion over its shoulder and into the air like it's nothing. Number 5. Hyenas It's not exactly common, but a hyena could kill a lion. But how? If they had him by the balls? No, this is no joke. What hyenas lack in teeth and strength, compared to the lion, they make up for with smarts. Especially the skilled hyena, who bites a buffalo right in his privates and starts eating him alive. What are they doing? Keep in mind, even lions often don't come out alive after a confrontation with a buffalo. Now. A single hyena would probably never be able to take on a fearsome lion. But it's incredible what a pack of hungry hyenas will brave for food. Check out this lion, who almost regretted his decision to do a bit of exploring in the wet savanna when he was attacked by an enormous pack of starving hyenas. Outnumbered 20 to 1, the lion began questioning his rank in the food chain as the hyenas laughed and crackled while trying to smartly avoid the mighty wildcat's jaws and bite pieces out of his behind. The lion was beginning to question whether he'd make it out alive, but thankfully, another friend with a mane showed up just in time, causing the hyenas to scatter. It's true then that even for 20 hyenas, a pair of male lions is too much to take on. But it's likely the lion would have met the same fate as the buffalo had he had not been so lucky. Before we move on to our next fearsome lion killer, we have a quick challenge that'll just take 5 seconds to complete. So, here's the deal. Leave us a like, smash that subscribe button, and turn on notifications, and you'll win 10 years of incredible luck. Try it, it actually works. Number 4. Rhino Rhinoceroses are lion's natural prey, 
but even lions rarely attack adults. Some weak, injured, and old rhino adults have reportedly been killed by lions. But rhino calves are usually the wildcat's main targets, and it's obvious why. A white rhino can weigh up to 5,000 pounds, which is easily 10 times the weight of an adult lion. Rhinos are also thick-skinned, and their large horns have scraped bodies on cars like it's nothing. If they can do that to metal, well, the lions don't want to find out what it will do to flesh and bone. Even an elephant is wary of that horn. Although rhinos mostly lose territorial disputes with elephants, there have been cases where herds of rhinos even chased off an elephant. Rhinos aren't just protective of themselves, they're protective of each other as well. So if a predator approaches a herd of dangerous rhinos and can't frighten them into running to isolate a member and pick them off, then they will usually just give up, because they know very well that a single blog from a rhino's horn can mean the end of their lives. Number 3. Hippopotamus Round and tumbly as they may appear, hippos are often cited as the most dangerous land mammal in Africa, killing an estimated 500 people a year. Now, they won't go out of their way to attack a lion, but hippos are highly territorial and won't shy away from a fight against anyone, not even a lion. A single lion knows all too well it can't take on a hippo. Hippos size each other up by opening their mouths up to 150 degrees wide, stretching it up to 5 feet length. Meanwhile, a lion's jaws are hinged, so it can only open its mouth 11 inches. Even if a lion could open its mouth wide enough, the hippo's hide is still way too tough and thick for a lion to do any real amount of damage. However, the opposite is true if a hippo were to bite a lion, at 650 psi. The lion's bite is peanuts compared to hippos, with their incredibly strong 1825 psi bite. The hippo only needs to land a single bite and it's over for the mighty wildcat. And if you thought speed would be an issue, well, Hippos can actually run up to 30 miles per hour. Who knew? Case in point, hunting a hippo may be the last thing a lion does. Number 2. Elephant When lions hunt elephants, they usually target youngsters or females, and they almost always attack from behind. Care to guess why? Just take a look at this shocking but incredible video of an angry elephant ramming and killing a buffalo with its horns. That's right, if you thought the earlier video of a buffalo throwing a lion over its shoulder looked effortless, well, just imagine what an elephant can do. In brute strength, elephants are the strongest mammals and the strongest land animals in the world. African elephants can weigh up to 14,000 pounds and are so strong, they can carry almost twice their body weight. And although most elephants can't run faster than 15 miles per hour, a few African elephants have surprisingly reached top speeds of up to 25 miles per hour. The lion may be a lot faster, but one of them attacking an elephant is about as effective as trying to cut down a tree. It will waste its energy, and eventually the elephant will crush it, or break it in half. Sure, there have been a few famous cases of lions killing elephants, but only when there was a huge pride of around 30 of them. Smaller lion prides wouldn't dare attack them, and a single lion will just make the elephant mad. Which is why most of the time, when they see an elephant, they keep their distance, or run. Number 1. Tiger When a tiger fights, it fights to kill. Being a little more social, lions try to win without having to fight if they can resort to intimidation, wrestling, and rolling first. They do not get serious from the beginning. But a tiger does not win by intimidation and social challenge. It goes into a fight all or nothing. So, how would the two match up in a standoff? Well, tigers are known to weigh up to 800 pounds, while large African lions weigh up to 550 pounds, while that's hundreds of pounds more. It's important to note that the tiger is not a lot bigger than a lion. This indicates the tiger has far greater muscle density, and therefore, a lot more strength. Some even say a tiger is easily 10 times stronger than a lion. Unlike lions hunting prides for more efficiency, tigers single-handedly hunt and kill large adult buffaloes, weighing up to a ton all on their own. In historical accounts where lions and tigers have fought in captivity, the tiger often came out the victor. 
The most recent account happened in 2011, when a tiger at the Ankara Zoo attacked a lion after finding a gap in the fence separating their cages. Officials said the tiger severed the lion's jugular vein in a single stroke with its paw, leaving the animal dying in a pool of blood. In 1857, a tiger at the Bromwich Zoo broke into a lion's cage and succeeded in ripping up its stomach, killing the lion within just a few minutes. Bottom line, the jungle has a new king. And that's it for today's video. Which other animals do you think could potentially kill a lion? Let us know in the comments below. And if you like... The lion with its bite force and strong muscles makes many opponents wary. With aggressive blood, the lion may get mad and is ready to attack any animal, no matter how big. The giraffe is trying to run away from the lion's claws. The lion tries to jump on people to cling to giraffes. But because of his aggressiveness, the lion received a bitter ending. He was constantly hit by the giraffe with many kicks. The lion is ruling the whole big, so any ill-fated animal targets will have a tragic end. But facing the rhinoceros, which is known as the neck of the natural world, the lion must be wary. An adult rhino weighs 450 to 1,360 kilograms. The skin is thick and the horns are long. With those advantages, the rhinoceros quickly moved to chase the lion out of his territory. Discovering a rhinoceros struggling in the lake, the mother lions approach, trying to approach. Rhinos are vegetarians. The main food is grass, but not because of that. Rhinos are an easy poke. But maybe the lions didn't mind that. It started to launch the first moves. Fortunately, the rhinoceros managed to climb ashore. It quickly responded to the lion. With thus high social nature, lions unite to defeat the prey. One lion acts as a decoy. Another lion attacks the rhino's rear. They combine very smoothly, but they do not fool the rhino. In an open land, Hippo is sunbathing. The lion recklessly attacks the hippo. But hippo discovered it turned back to attack the lion. The hippo uses its power to lift the lion up. The lion was completely exhausted from the weight of the large muscular hippo. The clip was recorded on an image of an old hippo with many injuries that must have gone through countless fierce battles while walking on a dirt road. Suddenly, it chased the lion, causing the lion to run towards the herd. One male lion is sunbathing on the cliff in the middle of the river. The hippos in the water, seeing the lion's appearance, also curiously approached. The hippopotamus rushed to attack the lion, wanting to drive the lion out of its territory. With the hippos' frantic attacks, the lion had to jump into the river to be able to escape. The lion is preparing for the hunt. It is aiming for the sable antelope in the distance. The lion carefully approached its prey, observing the sable antelope's every move. Sable antelope went to a dry river to drink water. Realizing the opportunity, the lion quickly rushes to attack the prey from behind. Attacked, the sable antelope tries to poke the hunter with her horns. The sharp horns caused the lion pain and ran into the river. The hunt ended. The lion regretfully watched the sable antelope run away. The lion took the opportunity to jump on the zebra and attack it. The zebra panicked and ran very fast to make the lion fall off its body. The zebra fell down after running at high speed. At this time, the lion clinging to the zebra also fell. Zebras run as fast as they could into the forest. The cold-blooded lion saw a pair of mother and cubs walking. Immediately, this lion had a plan in mind to steal the baby elephant from the mother elephant. The lions run to catch the baby elephant. The alert mother elephant promptly discovered the lion running. The mother elephant began to attack to protect her cubs. 
big trunk of the mother elephant has chased away the hunters. The male lion constantly clings to the back of the baby elephant to find a way to defeat the prey. The elephant tried to run, but the strong force behind him made the elephant fall. Two lions try to press the person to bite on the neck. The lion is planning to step into the heavy, still water. The crocodile has discovered and is following. The lion was lucky to escape the fatal bite of the crocodile and it quickly escaped. Crossing rivers and lakes is always full of hidden dangers. Like the two lions in this video, while crossing the river it encountered a crocodile. With quick reactions, a lion was able to run ashore just in time. The belligerent lion rushes to the center of the buffalo herd to capture a young buffalo. Its belligerence was paid for by the wrath of the mother buffalo. The mother buffalo herded the lion into the swamp and used its sharp horns to hurl it into the air. Receiving crushing blows, the lion finds a way to escape. A lion has been lurking for a long time. The mother buffalo just chased the lion away and then the other lion arrived. Determined not to let any animal threaten her child, the mother buffalo tries her best to chase away this male lion. The lion approaching its prey after spotting a herd of saber-horned antelopes feeding nearby. The saber-horned antelope still calmly grazing without knowing the presence of the hunter. Lions hide behind bushes, watching their prey attentively. When the time came, the two lions quickly rushed to attack and control the saber-horned antelope. An antelope with sharp horns is walking closer to the water. The lion saw and began the strategy of approaching and taking down the antelope. When discovered, the antelope panicked and ran away immediately. But unfortunately, the lion chased close. It jumped up and pressed the antelope down. When the antelope dives, the lion immediately bites the neck to attack it. One bite makes the antelope painfully unconscious. The deer was drinking water by the lake when a lion came out of nowhere to catch it. But reacting quickly, the fawn ran away. The head-to-head -head confrontation between the lion and the antelope looks very dramatic. They crashed into each other, causing both sides to fall under the wall. It looked quite painful. When falling, the antelope seemed to know its fate, but there was no way to escape from the two lions. With this grip, the antelope certainly has no chance to escape. Following the lion's footsteps, porcupines spot prey today. Constantly approaching the prey, the lion decides to attack the furry porcupine spot. Only released a light attack, but the lion received many sharp spikes in return. Rhino blatantly entered the territory of the lions. It's quite comfortable in this land, even chasing lions. Rhinos are likened to the tank of destruction of the natural world. Its aggressive nature makes it not afraid of any battle, especially territorial disputes. Lions have to adapt to that too. Porcupines panicked and ran away from the leopard's pursuit. Leopards very quickly intercept the hedgehog's head. As always, the leopard rushes to attack its prey. But this time, it hit the wrong opponent. Not only did it can't catch the hedgehog, but it hurts by the thorns. The dog and the furry porcupines had a decisive battle in the swamp. Despite receiving sharp thorns, the dog still frantically attacked porcupines. And 
in the end, it gave us extremely painful. The area that the dog's oral cavity and the entire face of the dog is pinned with thorns. With superiority in both physical and strength, the elephant easily knocked down the mother rhino with her tusks. The force of the elephant's butt was so great that the mother rhino nearly crushed the baby rhino. The elephant did not intend to give up. It pushed the rhino into the puddle. Rhinos quickly run away. Most rhinos live alone and they avoid encountering each other. It's not a good thing for these two rhinos to meet each other. The truth is that, after a few minutes of greeting, they rush into battle. The sharp horn is the most powerful weapon in this battle. A rhinoceros uses its horn to repeatedly butt into another rhino. The rhino reacted quickly, but the injury is inevitable. The belligerent hyena actively attacked the giant rhino. The hyenas arrive and the array of battle distracts the concentration of the rhinos. Facilitating a hyena to attack the rhino's tail. Despite meticulous planning, the hyenas still failed. After a period of ambush, the leopards jump out to attack the furry porcupines. However, the leopard's attack is very well counter-attacked by the furry porcupines. Porcupines was noticed by a python. The python approached and attacked the porcupines to eat this large prey. But it didn't expect the porcupines to use its spikes on his body as a counter-attack measure. The python didn't get anything, its body is still pierced by many thorns. Porcupines has strayed into the lion's territory. What is the fate for this porcupine? Let's follow right now. The lions are not aggressive. It is very wary of this particular prey. Some of the lions left and they realized that it was not an easy prey to deal with. In the dark of night, lions surround the porcupine. And this porcupine constantly ruffles its sharp fur to intimidate its opponent. They struggle to find a way to defeat this small prey to no avail. There are frequent conflicts within the rhinoceros community. Right now, the biggest rhino in the herd, but for some reason, is attacked on its own. It knocks up another adult rhino. After the rampage, this giant rhino also calms down. At Kariga Animal Sanctuary in South Africa, a fierce battle between rhinos and buffaloes is occurring. With a pretty obvious difference in body shape, the rhinoceros easily knocks down the buffaloes. After that, the buffalo took action, but it was not very effective. It was also hit hard by the rhinoceros. Rhinos gain momentum and butt into the wild buffalo, causing it to continuously retreat. The surrounding herd of buffalo can only watch, but dare not approach the stop. But with any army of wild buffalo like this, it also scares the rhino. Was the victor, but the rhinoceros had to leave this land too. The cunning leopard only attacks the furry porcupines. The poor porcupine tries to protect its young. Taking advantage of its thorny feathers, the father and mother porcupine continuously launch spikes to chase away the enemy. These two porcupines have very good defense skills, not a single gap. Seeing the situation is not good, the leopard gives up. The porcupine has had bad luck when it encounters two big, fierce dogs. The two sides are extremely fierce in battle when the dogs continuously attack the porcupine. 
The two dogs run around the hedgehog and make noises to scare the animal. Looks like the result is not very good. The lake has only one, but both rhinos and hippos love it. Hippo fights forward, opens mouth wide and step by step, repels the rhino. The rhinoceros deepened, leaving the horn right into his opponent's neck. The hippo is even more ferocious, chasing the rhino behind. The rhinoceros doesn't fit either. It's not as scary as the last time, but if it stabs straight into the hippo's neck. They finally decided to take a break for a few minutes before going into the second half. To occupy this lake, rhinos must chase this ferocious hippo. Rhinos are warned by hippos again, constantly retreating. With just one warning like that, the rhino weakly ran away. Porcupine standing alone, the leopard slowly approaches. The leopard lies down, trying to find a way to attack the animal with the spineless abdomen. The leopard uses its paw to touch the furry porcupine to probe its prey, continuously using its claws to attack the prey. Knowing that he encounters a prey that's not easy to eat, the leopard gives up and leaves. The black cobra looking for food. A baby hedgehog is walking in the field. By chance, it came across the hedgehog. The snake has discovered its prey and is figuring out how to catch it. The hedgehog is unafraid and ready to face it. The baby hedgehog keeps biting at the cobra's tail. Seeing the dangerous situation, the snake retreated. Rhino makes a giraffe. Rhinos do not stop teasing this animal and must receive an appropriate consequence. Enjoy the direct kick from the giraffe, the rhino runs away. Elephants and rhinos are mammals possessing huge size on land. However, every match happens, elephants always show their outstanding bravery. As in the following video, rhinos and elephants have a fight in the background before showing it out. The rhino throws his horn at the elephant. The elephant is also ready to respond. The elephant gradually approached, pushing the rhino out of its territory. But it's not easy. After a while of pushing and shoving, the rhinoceros also left. The small porcupine faced two huge lions. It slowly counterattacks with its sharp fur. A lion tries to hold the hedgehog with its front legs, but the sensitive hedgehog runs away. It doesn't have the strength and speed to run away, but the hedgehog has a weapon that always makes the predators falter. The hunt of the leopard with the furry porcupine goes on continuously on this vast steppe. In the end, the leopard was still injured by the porcupine's spawns. Visitors had a bad satisfaction when witnessing the battle between rhinos and lions with their own eyes. In the face of the crowded lions, the rhinoceros showed no concern. However, it still chose to leave this battle. While the rhinoceros turned away, the lion took the opportunity to bite the back of the rhino. However, the thick skin of the rhinoceros quickly made the lion give up. The grasslands return to a peaceful state. The highway becomes a battlefield for leopards and porcupines. The leopard's front legs were full of blood when it stubbornly hit the porcupine. The porcupine tried to run away, but the leopard kept attacking. After a long time because of the pain, the leopard chose to stop the fight. Black night is the ideal time for many animals to do their hunting. Facing the lions, even the hedgehog alone is still very calm.
The battle lasted from night to dawn, and the lions still have not caught this prey. Finally, the lions got tired and decided to let the hedgehog run away. Because they did not want to share the cool lake with the lions, the rhinoceros had a spectacular chase. It frantically ran after the lions and caused dust to fly. Despite its bulky appearance, the rhinoceros moves very quickly. The lions are too many. The rhinos have been struggling forever and still have not been able to chase any lions. Two porcupines coincidentally encounter the Speed King on the grasslands, the leopards. The porcupines try to defend in the end, constantly ruffled defense. Meanwhile, two leopards persistently look for opportunities to attack. The attack plan failed. The leopard was covered with injuries. Porcupine spikes are all over the leopard's body. The leopard slowly approaches the porcupine's dangerously sensitive porcupine. It turns its head. The leopard senses danger from the sharp thorns. Although the porcupines are difficult to hunt, leopards are quite fond of this animal. The hedgehog uses its thorny feathers to shield itself from the leopard's claws. The battle to leave the forest to the highway is not over yet. In the end, the leopard is the first to give up. Mother rhino and daughter attacked by the hyenas. The purpose of these hyenas is the baby rhino. The mother rhino does not let them have the opportunity to approach the baby rhino. Mother rhino protects her baby from running away. It chases away the hyenas in the back. The peaceful scene between the rhino mother and the child did not last long. Another rhino suddenly rushes to goose the baby rhino. The mother rhino took a few minutes to react. She got a little angry at the other rhino. The duel between these two large animals is extremely exhausting. Finally, the mother rhino chased the other two rhinos away. The hippopotamus suddenly approached the rhinoceros and opened his mouth threateningly. Seeing that the rhino was indifferent to his actions, the hippo still chased after it. Although they don't want to cause trouble, the hippopotamus is too annoying and the rhino responds. The hippo was chased by a rhino until it was exhausted. Rhinos don't like to share their territory with any animals. Therefore, the mighty rhinoceros came to chase away these elephants. These elephants also don't fit. It knocks the log like a real-life delinquent. The action scared the little heart of the rhinoceros. We often see how the lion hunts its prey in documentaries. But this video will be different. For millions of years, prey animals have developed defense mechanisms against predators. They fight to the death against lions thanks to their horns, teeth and powerful muscles. How strong is a lone lion actually against prey animals? You will not believe what you see in this video. Number 1. Hippopotamus On Gainla as it is, the hippopotamus is the world's deadliest large land mammal killing an estimated 500 people per year in Africa. Hippos are aggressive creatures and they have very sharp teeth. They can cut a lion in half with its sharp and long teeth. And you wouldn't want to get stuck under one, at up to 3000 kilograms. They can crush a human to death. In the wild, hippos typically live up to 40 years. The animals which can reach up to 4 tons inside. 
generally reach 50 years of age when in captivity. Number 2. Rhino While these horned beasts are potentially very dangerous, they generally prefer to keep to themselves. Despite that attitude, rhinos are not pacifists and when they feel threatened, they'll steer their large, dangerous bodies directly toward the fight. The black rhino has a reputation for being extremely aggressive and charges readily at perceived threats. Adult rhinos normally have no natural predator, thanks to their imposing size as well as their thick skin and deadly horns. Number 3. Buffalo Also known as Black Death, the buffalo can be extremely dangerous and is said to have killed more big predators than any other animals in Africa. Buffalo is most aggressive when it has been wounded or if one of the calves from the herd is under attack. Can a buffalo kill a lion? African buffaloes have few predators and are capable of defending themselves against lions and they can kill lions easily if they attack at the right moment. Number 4. Zebra One of Africa's most dangerous prey animals is zebra. Zebras also have very different temperaments to horses. They are far more aggressive and a lot more dangerous. KO! Zebras have been known to kick each other to death. They will viciously bite any human that comes to close. And there are even many accounts of zebras killing lions. There have been numerous recorded cases of zebras killing lions, generally by a swift kick to the head that at the very least breaks the jaw, resulting in the cat's eventual starvation. Number 5. Porcupine Porcupine is not an aggressive animal. It will only attack if it is threatened. Some animals are experts at attacking porcupines. Porcupines have soft hair, but on their back, sides and tail, it is usually mixed with sharp quills. Porcupines cannot shoot them at predators, but the quills do detach easily when touched. Porcupines can easily kill many lions with their sharp quills. These quills sink into the lion's heart and throat. Number 6. Giraffe Although they are more likely to run from an attack than fight back, giraffes are not completely defenseless. A swift kick from one of their long legs can do serious damage to unlucky lion. Giraffes defend themselves against predator by kicking with either the fore or hind feet. Their large and heavy hooves can break the back of lions. <laughs> lions, hyenas, and our other many predators cannot reach their throats because they are very tall. By the way, fully grown giraffes can reach up to 20 feet tall. Number 7. Elephant Elephants are usually peaceful animals. All elephants may become aggressive when sick, injured, or harassed. Lions don't attack the elephant herd. Lions will usually avoid adult elephants and attack youngsters only if they have become separated from the herd. Elephants are exceptionally smart creatures. They have the largest brain of any land animal and three times as many neurons as humans. Thanks to their intelligence and big tip, they are protected from lion's attacks. Number 8. Warthog Smart, stout and sturdy, warthogs proved to be one of Africa's most durable and indoor prey species. Warthogs have longer legs than other pigs. Besides being good at dodging and running, warthogs are not afraid to fight. They use their sharp canine teeth as weapons. While they are not normally an aggressive animal, warthogs are known to injure predators with their sharp tusks when cornered. Warthogs are very dangerous for lions hunt, can even kill them. Lions have to be very careful. Number 9. Wildebeest 
wildebeests have a maximum running speed of around 50 miles per hour. The primary defensive tactic is herding, where the young animals are protected by the older, larger ones while the herd runs as a group. They are a dark black with stripes. They have horns that are curved to help them have protection from enemies. They can be seriously injured by horn the lion. And number 10. Gorilla Although it is very difficult to encounter them in nature, a gorilla can easily kill a lion. Gorillas have large muscular arms and can do incredible damage when angry. During a lion attack, he can protect himself with his strong arms. Also, you can find detailed comparison video of gorilla and lion on my channel. Thanks for watching. I'm Blondie Fox.